from one drama to another, Romeo and Juliet officially opened on Broadway last Thursday. Our Broadway reporter and witch, Elizabeth Gottlieb, is here to tell us about the show's success. Sam Gold's production of Romeo and Juliet officially opened last Thursday. The play stars Rachel Zegler and Kit Connor at the Circle in Square Theater. To celebrate the show's official opening, the production released Man of the House, which is one of two songs Zegler sings in the production. Although this version of Romeo and Juliet is not a musical, the show did not hesitate to include Zegler's powerful voice. Jack Antonoff wrote The Man of the House alongside Ryan Beatty. With the show's opening came critics' reviews. Entertainment Weekly compared the revival to the Brat album by Charlie XCX and the TV show Euphoria. They said the production is a glittering, queer, Gen Z take on Shakespeare's play that is wonderfully wild and visually stunning. The critics applauded the modern take on the famous balcony scene where Romeo does a pull-up to kiss Juliet. The scene has since gone viral on TikTok. Entertainment Weekly disliked how the play uses the same actor for multiple characters, saying it pulls viewers out of the drama of the scene. Deadline said the revival was like Elizabethan dance club with 21st century moves. Deadline commented on the show's youthful energy of the play 420 years old. The Hollywood Reporter said Gold's revival fully commits to its concept and sustains it surprisingly well. The Hollywood Reporter said that the standout of the cast was Connor with his innocence and sorrow in his role, yet says that Zegler did not match her co-star's passion for her role. The one thing that critics can agree on is that Romeo and Juliet is a timeless play and that Gold's Gen Z take on the revival is a success. And if you do not believe me, take a look at the sold-out theater every night.